Morning everybody. Morning. Welcome back to Life on the Run. It's very benign weather and we ought to be out there. Would be nice to be out there. But we can't go out there. And I'll tell you why we can't go out there. Just to clear some things up. When we come here to Tracy's, we don't freeload on her. We give Tracy what we would spend on sites, on site fees. The money allocated for site fees goes to Tracy when we're here. And uh, Pat's money that she uses for food and eating out goes towards food um, while we're here as well. So we're not freeloading on Tracy and eating all her food. So we're contributing. So the reason why we originally sold the house was because we couldn't afford to live in a motorhome and have a house. The same thing applies. We can't afford to be here and go out there as well. So that's why we can't go out there. Now some of you might say, well, you can go off at day. But this place called Hell, <laughs> otherwise known as Leeds, is just gummed up with cars. To go out for the day from Leeds, from here, the moment you set foot out of the front door here, you're in traffic. And by the time you get anywhere worth going to, you've only just about cleared the traffic. So you're in traffic. Traffic, traffic, traffic. All the time. So there's, I don't see, I don't take any pleasure in it personally. Um, driving in all this traffic around here. So that puts me off going off with the camper for days. So when we're here, we're here. When we're out there, we're out there. Never the twain shall meet. <laughs> <laughs> yeah. So just thought we'd um, uh, clear that point up. Uh, now, <laughs> you had to bring the bookcase round yesterday as well, didn't you? Oh, I did, yeah. yeah. I, um, Tracy's friend was here and she, she helped me bring the bookcase round the back of the, the house. Further down the road, there's a, an alleyway with a door on it, and you can go down the to open that door in the alleyway, go down the steps, and it brings you out along the back of the other cottages alongside the canal here. So you can come so through other people's about back... About three of them, isn't there? About three other backyards and get to get to here, mm -hmm. and then bring it in through the back door, and that's what we did. Um, so that, that saved mm. Tracy a job. We had to put a big towel down over the decking because in next door the the decking in the middle is um, a stone circle so we put the towel down to the stone circle and then once you got in the circle we put it on the other side so you could come through a gate didn't we yeah because the tracy put um metal railings and two gates mm. in to the to the next two houses to the, her house and the one next door, which Tracy and David own yeah. as well. So, well, that sounds a bit... Does that sound a bit complicated? It does. Oh, sorry. Yeah, when when we when we bought these, there's two that we bought separately, joined them both up, and then when we sold them um, to Tracy, uh, there's, there's, if you go back... Is there a bit of footage? I think there's a video called Tracy Bought a House. Was it? Right. Tracy Bought a House or mm. something. Sold the house to Tracy or something like that. 
that explains what we did. And so they they own own the two. The two. Um and they they put the wrought iron railings around them to separate them off from other other properties mm. along here. And put gates in. Yeah, put gates in. Um yeah. Is that it? Yeah, um, you want to show them bookcase? Do I want to show them the bookcase? Mm. We could, we could do. I mean, it's an old, an old bookcase. We're not quite. You can throw. Yeah, do you want to? Into the back room. Yeah. Yeah. This. This is a, a little oh. area where we. That's Ernie. Where that's Ernie in his. In his case. You put that light on there, Pat. And this, this is the, the back room here. Um, so this is the, that's the bookcase there. We bought that bookcase from a, when that when, well, it isn't an antique, but that that tape needs taking off. Yeah. It will just put on there to keep the doors from opening while we are carrying it. Mm. So that shouldn't be there. That tape. Yeah. Yeah, we bought that many, many years ago. Don't know where we bought it, to be honest. Probably Amswell um, Antiques or somewhere like that. Yeah. Yeah, probably. Um, yeah. This is just a little sitting area and tracing... Mm -hmm. They have a projector, projector up there. On that wall. And it projects on, onto that wall there. Mm -hmm. Yeah. That's a downstairs shower. Yeah. Tracy's yeah. downstairs, toilet and shower. So you don't have to run up two flights of steps. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, that's right. Yeah, there's two flights of steps to the next bathroom. Up there and up another flight. <laughs> there's That's the place we couldn't get the cabin at when we were trying to bring it down them steps. Well, when Tracy were trying to get it down, they couldn't get it under that bit there. That's why... It had, oh, to come it had to come round the back. Mm. Uh. Yeah, I more thoughts about van life as well. It, I keep provoking people and getting comments about it, about it, and. Interesting thing. Yeah. What's your little red thing? What red it's thing? little red thing on your jumper keeps flashing. Well, it's it's telling you it's working. Oh, right. It's counting down the seconds and, or counting up I the seconds. I don't know anything about things like that. <laughs> She's a Luddite, is Pat. <laughs> Total Luddite. Yeah. Um... Yeah, I don't know how to put, I, 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 I've been thinking about it and I, I knew I wouldn't be able to get me, marshal, marshal my words to get it out. What, because my train of thought is, is a bit confusing anyway, but we, the whole idea of breaking the mould of of living, you know the 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 idea of um, the mortgage. Or I, I did made a video about carrying this weight on our shoulders. That the, the the system in which we live piles all these burdens on our shoulders <clears throat> that we have to carry through life. Monthly debits going out for this, that, and other, and one thing and another. All that. The videos on there. You need to watch our videos, the ones that we've made already. <laughs> it explains a lot. Uh, well, can YouTube become like that? Can YouTube become a Damocles? Oh, that you're carrying around with you. <laughs> it, yeah. Do you, you, you want to you wanna escape? 
and live in a motor home and um and then you decide to do youtube videos and they take over so that your life revolves around youtube videos what you're doing is not just a kind of relaxed spontaneous decision about what, what i'd like to do it's planned for videos you can see hours out planned can't you well, I don't, I can, In a way. I can see, I, I can sort of see how it could become like that as well. <laughs> it could get hold of you and, and be another, another master that you're living yeah. under. Yeah. I just wondered, because Pat and I, we are not the Edmund Hillary and Sherpa Tenzin of the YouTube word. We are Andy Pandy and Lou Below. <laughs> that's, that's, that, that, that's what we are. You are only have someone of our age who will know who Andy Pandy and Lou, and Lou Below <laughs> we, Because we ain't climbing mountains. We're, 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 there's not going to be much adventure. No. It's a tamed back version of YouTube. If you when you follow us, we're not. We're not gadding about all over. We're not walking the walks, climbing the hills, finding the monuments. And even when we do, if I guess it's phone in charge properly. <laughs> yeah, no, yeah, um, and that's another thing. We are restricted by oh, dear. the equipment we have, which is the minimum. We use the basic, most basic minimum requirements to make these videos. Um, so yeah, the, well, there's not, it, it's all going to, very simple and very low key. My epic walk didn't get recorded. <laughs> Your epic, no, epic it, walk. No, it didn't. Yeah, that's right. I, I had the energy that day and the yeah. epic walk. Didn't get recorded because his typical. phone run out. <laughs> that is typical. Yeah. The one day that Pat gets a surge of energy, we can't film it. <laughs> and it ended with quite a an interesting area, wasn't it? At the end of that war. Yeah, it was. Mm. It um. It would have been nice to have um, to driven and been able to park over that end somewhere mm. and had a, had a look. Yeah, but then we'll that, do that that's what time, you find maybe. you find out about places that you've never been to before, don't you? Mm. You know, it, you've never been before. You've no idea what to expect no. from a place, um, which is part of the charm, isn't it? Yeah. yeah. If we go back, we could do, we could do that, mm. we? and I think. Possibly we would go back there because it were interesting. Well, that site was a decent site, yeah, yeah. but very popular with people. Mm. Um, so it, it, you'd have to go out of season. I reckon you'd struggle to get Probably on that. says that all the time. Oh, well, I do, yeah. Well, because when you when you find a site which is near a lot of facilities, people go there. Yeah. Mm. So that's popular, so people go, uh, and yeah. you. you you have to have a regime where you're booking in advance to get on places like that. And yeah. we don't do that. No. No. <laughs> there you go. There you go. Um, yeah. You keep it short. No. <laughs> oh, keep, keep it short. Who says that? Uh, somebody did. Did they? Yeah. That's short then. Yeah. I said, are you dropping in? <laughs> uh, bye. Bye. <laughs> Surgery uh, today to take Pat to our blood tests to see what, what's happening with the sugar. Now, well, this is the day we find out whether Pat's been cheating on her diet. I haven't. <laughs> you. <laughs> uh, right. 
uh, we'll see. <laughs>